What do you think, buddy? You ready? <laughs> I think so. Yeah. Yeah. All right, everybody. Welcome back, Athlete for Life. Good to be back. It's been a been a little bit, but uh, I'm back with another video. This is going to be a fun one. Uh, I'm going to give you kind of like a, a little mini training day here. Uh, Nick and I are not going to the to the box today, or or doing CrossFit at the box. We're going to do a workout in his garage. Uh, so I'm going to walk you over there, and you can actually see how close he lives to me because he literally is my neighbor. Uh, so this should be this should be a fun one. We're gonna do some uh, a lot of conditioning stuff today in, in preparation for the CrossFit Open. Work on some engine. Uh, so if you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure you subscribe. Uh, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Drop a comment down below. I'd be more than happy to uh, respond and, and answer any questions. So without further ado, let's get this going and let's head on over to to Nick's. Have turned. Right. <laughs> they have. <laughs> Welcome. Hi, how are you? I did a little walk over, show people Hi, how far, we how live. close we are. <laughs> yep. have to drive. Yep. All right. So we're here. Made it. Some Time to uh, yeah, yeah. Do a little, do a little engine work. Yeah. Look at that rower. Let's get a shot of that beautiful piece of equipment that you fixed. All right. We'll get some use out of that today. Yeah. So we're, we're trying to put this workout together right now because we got the rower, uh, we got the bike, and we're gonna do double under. So we're trying to figure out the best way to kind of dissect and attack this workout uh, with two of us so we can kind of keep it balanced uh, with the amount of work we're gonna do on each uh, piece of equipment. So uh, we're kind of brainstorming right now. Nick's looking at some conversions over, uh, you know, if we're doing distance on the rower, what that will be on the bike. So a little, Kind of a little bit of a math equation here of, of trying to figure out the best way to kind of do this so um that's what we're working on but then we're going to get we're going to hit it beautiful day uh we got everything kind of outside and uh we're going to get after it yeah right let's do this right uh here's a workout nick and i came up with four rounds for time uh we can do a 50 dub buy-in and then one person goes to the row one person goes to the bike 100 calorie row, 70 calorie bike. Uh, after each round, rest two minutes, and then we will flip. Whoever's on the row will go to the bike, whoever's on the bike go to the row. We'll continue that for three more rounds, and then uh, we will do a cash out of 50 dubs. So, should be good. We, a little more conditioning, uh, preparation for the open, work on that engine. So we'll, we'll see how this goes. This is, we haven't done this. We just came up with it on the fly. A little freestyling, uh, so we'll see. This should be fun. Looking forward to it. All right, we got the workout set. We are ready to roll. Beautiful day. Look at that. Beautiful floor today. We're back to normal here, so it's it's pretty warm. Actually, we might get a good sweat going on this one. I actually busted out the old school wristbands here. Catch all that sweat. Uh, so get this rolling. Really don't know what to expect. Actually, should be a good one. Nick came up with a lot of this, but we kind of agreed to keep it uh, more endurance, condition-based. What do you think, buddy? You ready? <laughs> I think so. Yeah. Yeah. I guess so, yeah. All right. Yeah, we'll see, see what how, happens. Yeah, we'll see what happens. Have, oh, a lot of this stuff we do is like one big fitness experiment. So yeah, for real. Another fitness experiment going on here. We'll see. Uh, we'll see how we both fare, but. Should, should be good. We're burning like what, what do we say? Like a thousand calories yeah, here. About 800 to yeah, almost eight hundred to a thousand calories in this workout. So uh, it should be good. So here we go. go.
All right, people, that wraps that one up. I always like showing you guys the aftermath. So uh, here's Nick. How you feeling, brother? Right, I feel good. Yeah, that was a good one. Yep. Like it wasn't like one where you hit red line. It's just a lot of just finding your pace and holding it. Um, I really like that one. That was good. Yeah, that was a good little yeah. on the fly freestyle. Yeah. Throwing that one together, I agree. Yeah. We haven't really done a straight up conditioning like that in a while. Yeah, yeah I need to start doing more of this. Engine. Like, yeah. Yep. Just like, you know, the open is going up. Yep. That's going to be all engine. Yep, it absolutely is. And the dubs, I need to. Like, I got lucky with that first round of 50 because that barely ever happens. No, it only happens when we go head to head. Right? Yeah. <laughs> At the, in our garages because then when yeah. we get to the box, yeah. you start tripping up for some reason when we're yeah. here in our home driveways. You're able to put it together because yeah. that helped you out big time. Yeah. So, yeah, it was, yeah, it was good, man. I like that one. Definitely felt it. I'm definitely breathing, breathing yeah. heavy. Yeah. Moving fast. It's always the, the goal. Yeah. Yeah. So that wrap it up. We're done for the day. I don't think we're doing anything else, are we? I'm gonna do Yeah, maybe a little later. Gee, as I, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I might do some strength stuff. We'll see. But uh, that wraps it up. Hope you liked it. Subscribe. Hit that like button. Get the notification bell going. Drop a comment. All that good stuff. And we'll see you on the next one.